Alright, let's see how stupid it is to go mining in the middle of the night. Probably pretty stupid. Oh, there's a lot of them. There's a lot of them. Oh, mining's a lot of fun. Let's get to over Poundy here. And he'll help me out. Poundy, go get him. Oh, that's a cop. Oh, where'd that happen? Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh. Who's next? Oh, boy. Come on, Poundy. Go get him. Go get him. You're dead. Oh, good job, Poundy. Alright, good morning and welcome to Not A Gamer Gaming. This is Genosis, the day 20 of Wasteland Wanderer. Now, doing a bit of mining last night, and I actually got a, a level uh, through that and quite a bit more. I even had a horde attack me, so Daph might actually show that in the beginning of this video, so we'll see. Also, there's a bit of a trick that um, I'm not sure people know about. See, when you get a mining book, actually one specific, the only mining book I've found so far... Oh god, I'm blind. Art of Mining, number one. So you can craft basic resources like ore into compact stacks. That's stone and iron and lead and such. So uh, I, once you've gathered like a bundle, so like our stack, whatever, of stone or iron, whatever. I was doing this with iron earlier. If you craft that bundle, and I think it's when you when you were gathering it, because you see how much I'm getting experience for, for gathering stone. But watch what happens when I create that bundle. I got a 5,000 like, point jump right there. So that's kind of a trick. You can do that with all of the resources that way. So let's uh, try this again. Hold on. Let's. Uh, I'm just creating. Like, I don't know. I do this with my mine shaft sometimes. I just uh, make them into a uniform shape by putting frames. Sometimes I upgrade them, which is actually a you know good source of uh, experience if you if you like that kind of thing. All right. So I'm going to start this uh, next uh, this last section here. All right. Then I'm going to stack the bundle. I think it. I'm not 100 percent sure. Like let's see if I do nothing. I thought it only happens when you're gathering, but maybe it's when you do nothing. It doesn't seem to always work. No, there it is. 4,000 experience just for crafting it. I mean, I, I assume in it's intended or expected, I don't know. Like, I was doing this on the server the other day, and it just wouldn't work, wouldn't work. But then it just started working. So, I don't know, no rhyme or reason for it. There's some, some trick that make it happen every time that I don't know about, I am unsure. But anyways, we got two levels last night, which is fantastic. Um, now, I mean, we're, I could put, I'm going to leave strength alone. Like, I think I'm pretty good with strength right now. We got our skull crusher up. Ooh, with that mind. That is ready. We started crafting that before the end of the last episode. Modify. Let's get our big, big pink massive sledge ready to go. So we got ergonomic grept on. That's done and done. Um, yeah, you know what? I'm going to take this right off there. Get the weighted head. And I can put that where it should be right here. So we keep one more. Can I craft the burning shaft? Um, I cannot. Uh, what mods uh, can I craft? That's a good question. Um, bunker buster, me, fortify and crypt. Hmm. I don't see anything that would be super good on it. I mean, hunter if you're in hunting animals, I guess, but not really. I mean, I'll keep an eye out for something. I wonder, I mean, I may, would that work on it? I don't know. Yeah. It'll give me, like, look at the uh, melee damage and power attack damage. It goes up by uh, four or five. So the mod doesn't make sense there, but it does what it does. And I'll put something more that makes sense uh, next time. So, yeah, we got uh, we got some... I'll put this all this stuff away here. All this stuff away. All right, so... Um, oh, yeah, so let me show you one other thing I did last night. I finished my pit, and I was actually crafting some iron, which is why I was out gathering more. And we finally get our pit all, all bladed up. Look at that. That looks dangerous. I, I certainly hope I don't fall on that because I would not survive the trip. All right, uh, points. Let's talk about points. All right, so I said I was done strength for now. Uh, maybe I'll put into it later. So then we're looking at fortitude or perception or intellect. Let's see. What could I do with intellect? I could do robotics, which might be fun, but... That's going to be a big investment. Uh, better barter, which would be nice. And then we have... We kept talking about uh, doing infiltrator. <laughs> oh, should I do it? Um, I could get... I'd have to get Perception 4 for that. Okay, let's get Perception 4 either way, because I, I like getting Lucky Looter. I like salvage operations. 
Infiltrate, what would the first point get us? A half a second slower for landmines. That might be enough. And it take damage less from landmines. You know what? I did it. I just went and did it. I just friggin' did it. Alright, so that is our first decision for the day. Let's get my inventory cleared out. And, oh man, it's... This has to be Horde Night tonight. It has to be. I, it's... It's been six, seven days since it's been lost Horde Night, so it's getting awful close. But I would like to do some cool, big POI today. What is in the area? I mean, we have our traders nearby. There's, we could do, or did the cathedral over there. Um, I mean, a lot of the big ones are in the town, the waste of the desert town down here. Um, there was, hold on, Red Mesa. Huh. You know what? Um, let's go to Red Mesa. Why not? It's been a while since I've been there. I think I'd lusted it on the Archer series. But it has been a bit. Alright, again, I'm going to clear up my inventory and get on down there. Okay, we're going right by Jen. I mean, right on by it. May as well go check to see. I don't remember when her stash is resetting. Let's uh, close that door. And uh, let's check to see what she's got selling here today. Uh, salvage opera, salvage harvesting, sure. Um, I don't think I'll need any of that. Yeah, Skull Crusher might be good for that place. Mm, yeah, I think that's all I'm going to grab for now. I could grab the rest of the cans, but I'm um, fine. I'll grab that later, maybe. Let's see if there's any quests that are straight south. Don't look so good. Mm, that's straight north. You might want to get some antibiotics for mm, that. I'm going to grab this for later. Because oh, that's probably... Just, like, um, Wait a minute, hold on. I just thought of something. And all. Um, yeah, this... Oh, it's my... <laughs> <laughs> it's the house right next door. That's awesome. I just thought of a place I'd rather go than uh, Red Mesa. Yeah, I just thought of it. And I'll let you know when I get there. Alright, uh, I'm just about at my destination, and you can kind of see it in the distance. It's kind of cloudy since everything's wasteland. But there it is up there. The house on the hill. Can't believe I haven't thought of that already. Excuse me, miss. Oh, that sucks. Yeah, so no, that place has got a great... Um, actually library in there and I would like to hit that library very hard because I am missing a lot of magazines and a lot of things I could be learning I passed whatever path I'm supposed to take let me just uh, swing back around here um, the path might be hard to see because of wasteland being what it is but is it right now it's not there Whoa. is it I see a bear in the distance oh bird hold on hold on excuse me yes Bird, bird to see. Where are you? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Where did you go? Oh, you're on the ground. Jeez. Oh, yes, my new sledgehammer. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, so... Yeah, maybe the path is obscured now that everything's all, like, destroyed? Where is it? Maybe I'm blind. Maybe it's right here. You know, I think it's right here. It kind of... I don't know. Let's drive through. Oh, um, man, I don't see, oh, I think it's over there. Screw it, let's just start driving. Oh, there's the road. Oh, and a bird. And a bird. And it's good. Yeah, this is the road, so must have missed that. Where am I? Okay, I see where it is. It's right by those POIs that leads up here. My bad. All right, let's uh, get up to the house on the hill and get that place cleared. I'm. There's also a big loot cache at the bottom. And I do have some, um, uh, I think I have some candy with me. Oh, whoa, hold on. Go, 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 go. Man, this is really steep. I think I got some candy on me for the loot bonus, so that would be a good time to use it. And if I get that last level, I may put another point into, uh, Lucky Looter. No, no, never mind. I can't put in Lucky Looter. I need five. Anyways, enough babbling. Let's, uh, get on in here. Okay, we're getting into the house. And yes, I have an eye candy with me. That's for the loot bonus. We'll do that later. But, um, Skull Crushers. This might be a good time to use it. So what I'm going to do first is speed run the place. I'm just going to go through and smack a bunch of bitches as fast as I can with my new sledge. Which, uh, doesn't quite kill ferals. Well, I'm sure it'll uh, kill them if I actually aim for the head. Alright, let's, uh, kill a ton of zombies. Speed run, speed run, we're doing a... Speed run. Anytime we'll kill a zombie. Blah blah blah. I can't sing. Oh well. We're gonna stop now. Ah! Not even in their house. Friggin' birds. 
All right, this is the section I was looking forward to, the library. Um, I'm gonna make sure that everything's loaded because there's notoriously a hard zombie at the top of this. Let's get Poundy out. Oh yeah, there she is. You're probably feral. Yeah, you're feral. Hey, Lady. Oh, you were feral. Uh, should be another. Oh, irradiated. One shot, baby, right in the head. Yeah, the steel sledge, the power attack, 130 damage on the power attack with its all these mods. Okay, now let's look at all these books. I don't know if Lucky Goggles has anything to do with what kinds of books you get, but I'm going to put it on all the same. Ooh, that's a good one. Contact grenades. We're going to make that for the next Horde Knight. Armor doesn't slow you down in combat. That is more good news. Um, Crippola mod. Sniper rifle. Oh, wow. I, I am loving... I'm loving this place so far. Let's see. Uh, machine gunner. Excellent. Drum magazines. I would very much like one of those. We'll make that when we get home. Yeah, so far this place has been absolutely 100% worth it. You can't convince me otherwise. Alright, let's get the rest of these books and see if there's anything else worthwhile. Alright, I believe that was all the books. Uh, all we got actually was a military fiber being able to craft that. So, not a big deal. Oh, it's something up there. Yoink! Uh, can, I could stay there. But yeah, that was a very good uh, haul of books. Some very important things were learned. I would have liked that one where you, you don't detonate mines when you run over them. I mean, it kind of... Ooh, what was that, a barrel extender? Ooh, it was. Um, okay, I'm going to do this. Yeah. I'm just going to do it. So the barrel extender, that gives extra damage. Actually, let's compare that. So uh, it does 12 damage now. Yeah, so if you put the silencer on, you lose range. Wow, a lot of range. 60 range with the extender, and you get 6 more damage with the... Uh, okay, I call that a clear win. We'll save the silencer maybe for the... Uh, sni I'd love to craft a sniper rifle, but nah, I'll probably end up buying one or finding one. Anyways, enough babbling. Let's uh, get on down here. I almost forgot above this room. I know someone would have pointed it out if I didn't find it. But there was a uh, <clears throat> hidden crate up here. You can see the bedroom I ran through earlier. I just want to make sure that uh, I didn't miss this. Because it could be something nice. Oh, okay, another ratchet. So our game stage is definitely giving us the uh, tier 3 stuff now. Which is fantastic. Looking forward to the upgrades. Fantastic. We got a, a broken leg and an infection. Actually, we had a sprain before the infection, then we got broken, so... Oh, gosh. I know there's a medical pile or thing down in that little hut. So hopefully we can get that all fixed up, because I don't want to have to hobble through this entire POI. All right, we're to the bottom of this uh, little mine area or secret area of this, uh, this building. Hopefully, I will find the medical supplies I'm looking for. Yeah, there's two stashes here, so it's a good chance. Let's get a lucky looter goggles on just in case. Perfect. Splint. Love it. Love it when things just work out. Oh, two splints, just because uh, I might be doubly an idiot today. Oh, okay, I'm encumbered. I don't like that. We'll get rid of the paper. Um, we'll scrap the wire tool because we've got too many of those. Don't need uh, the plain old bandages. We've got plenty of those. And 11 stone. i got thousands at home. Uh, can I mod the water thing on me? Um, I could if I took off... Yeah, hold on. Let's just make use of my space here. I'm going to take off the muffler. And then I'm going to slam that onto my feet. Like so. There. Now we can, I can drink uh, just about anything. Perfect. Uh, I would like to cure my infection, but we can get that easily cured when we get home. Now, there's a, there's a, a bad room here. Oh, yeah, there is. Cop, irradiated. Uh, okay, we got enough ammo. Now, there's a trick I like to do. And if you're, you know, handy at breaking blocks, break this block right here. Right there. And I'm going to actually use uh, Poundy here, over here. Um, not right there, but probably. Oh, God, there's a lot of irradiated in there. Like, right over there is fine. So, Poundy is going to help us. Now, we're sneaking. Uh, everything's ready to go. Alright. I'm going to focus on the cop, because... Oh, it's two cops. Well, this is going to be fun. Focus on the cop, because the spit will get me faster than the irradiateds will melee through the wall. 
Okay, let's get this started. One. And two. Whoa. Excuse me, miss. You're done. You're done. Oh, did I get that cop? I did. Very nice. This this actually must output a lot of damage. 68. Nice. Uh, I think I can start meleeing at this point. Yeah, all the... Uh, all the super dangerous ones are out of the way. Well, that worked out really well. Isn't didn't it, Poundy? Yeah, Poundy did real. It did real good. My turn. All right. Uh, some more medical stuff. So I'm gonna loot all of these just in case we find something to uh, cure ourselves, which may or may not happen. No, I didn't think so. All right, looting goggles on. Here we go. The big event. The loot at the end. Oh yes. Okay, a lot of food. Medical pile, weapons bag, medium ammo pile, and Mr. Harden chest. We're gonna uh, we're gonna take a candy for that one because that's gonna take a bit. Okay, that's been cracked open. Let's look at these crates popped, and I'm gonna take that candy, eye candy, an extra ten percent or sorry, five loot bonus. Hold on, plus five loot bonus and plus ten percent loot bonus. Huh, interesting. I wonder if that accommodates for kind of low level issue where. If you're too low, you don't get much of a bonus. Oh well, let's uh, crack this last one open and see what we get. Okay, rad remover, I like it. That's actually really, that's gonna go on this instead of the ax thing, 100%, or the gun. Yeah, it might go on the gun, or this, I haven't decided. Um, we'll scrap the spear for parts, um, same with that. The rest of it will probably sell better. Okay, we're encumbered, but whatever, bike's outside. More steel spear parts and some bullets. Beer and coffee. Okay, gross sandwich. Modest amount of glue. Um, we're not going to add to our problems by eating a gross sandwich. You know what? I'm just going to toss it. And weapon bag. Okay, ergonomic brick, which is always nice. Uh, I'm sure I can remod things to fit properly. So, all right, let me take a second to do some inventory management and then get out of here. All right, we got all of the goodies. Everything's... Oh, almost missed that working stiff. Oh, a level two steel pickaxe. Uh, the level one did quite well for us, and this looks like a lot better. I, uh, yeah, I like that. Oh, I don't want to drop the oil shale, but um, I'm going to drop the beer. I'll be able to make my own soon enough. Uh, speakers, kind of useless, but I don't know. Maybe I'll have... Uh, sorry about the kids in the background. <laughs> you know, you know, parent, YouTube channel. Sometimes they have trouble, uh, you know, getting along. All right, this place is finished. It's still noon, so we still have time in the day. So maybe we'll get that quest done for Jen before we, uh, before the horde night happens. Oh, hello, sir. Excuse me. It's a little sore. Uh, what's with all the? Oh, hello. No, no, you're gonna bite me. Out of stamina. Here's an axe. Here's a sledge. There we go. Ah, oh, didn't notice my stamina was that low. Oh, and uh, yes, you there. Just taking a rest. Okay, all right, I'm gonna empty the crap into my bike, and uh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna loot that kitchen. I don't think I looted much in that kitchen. And then let's uh, get the hell out of here. All right, all clear. Let's get the heck out of here. I do have that infection like to take care of, but I'm sure we have plenty of time to get that quest done before we do. Oh boy, a little bit of a risk. This is gonna hurt, isn't it? Oh yeah, ouch. Oh, 40 health. That hurt a bunch. Ah. <sighs> Is that going to be hashtag new genosis for today? Yeah, it just might be. All right, let's take the nice, gentle slope down to the bottom. Now, isn't this convenient? Like, you can't ask for a better place for a quest. All right, I'm going to start off by getting my crap unloaded and uh, taking care of a few status effects off to the side. Uh, mainly the infection to start with and a bit of the uh, health loss. Oh, that's much better. Much better. All right, clearing the inventory and then heading over next door. We're no longer infected. Our uh, health is a little better than it was. And, uh, yeah, we're good to go. I, I just modded this uh, this hunting rifle just for fun. Might be a good uh, weapon to bring around. Now, uh, let's see, look at the damage. 104 range damage, like, and the 8 time scope. Like, you can zoom in and out with this. Very nice. Like, if there's uh, something out in the dark uh, during Horde Night, or not Horde Night, but the nighttime, I'm just going to snipe it. Okay, I know this place has been cleared, so... Um, yeah, may as well reset it. I'm just looking over my base make sure it didn't disappear. <laughs> uh, that would have sucked. Alright, let's uh, get on through here. Actually, let me, uh, 
try sniping something just for fun. Now that I have this in my hand, uh, is there anything nearby? Anything nearby? Oh, yeah, right there. Right there. Boop! And of course, the silencer only only does so much. Anyways, that was all the fun I wanted to have with that. Let's uh, get on through this POI and get this cleared. Uh-oh. That guy barely fits in there. And down you go. Bunk. Yes, that worked out just well. Uh, I guess I'll grab that. Yeah, this. Uh, I'm just taking my time. Just trying to rest my leg. Excuse me, sir. Oh! You drunk? Meat floor. Um, there's actually even a couple of bookcases upstairs, if I'm not mistaken. So that might be nice. But yeah, I'm trying not to sprint too much. I know I just sprinted there a second ago. It's a hard habit to break. And jumping hurts me. Every time I jump with a uh, sprain... Uh oh Holy crap! <laughs> it, uh, it actually reduces health. Whoa. Wow. Good flight on that one. Oh! <laughs> but there's some cases I can't avoid jumping, so I'm taking my licks as I go. No, that's, all, that's it for books. All right, we're just about done here. The uh, hidden crate thing. Or hidden uh, crate, what am I talking about? The hidden... Oh, it must be right there, right? Must be there. No? It says it's right in front... Oh, I see it. Right there? Yeah, there it is. Gotcha. Our quest is completed. Now to get our loot. Just need to kill uh, this guy right here. Boop. Very good. All right, what do we get? Loot goggles. Oh, hold on. Oh, phew, I glagged. Okay, looting goggles on. Let's see what we get. Uh, scrapping the boots. Another another turret. Some ammo, some parts. Okay. Um, some water and some water. Okay. All as well. Not too bad. Uh, let's see. I'm going to have to try to reduce my... Uh, oh, I'm too lazy to go walk all the way through. Yeah, see if we can... Oh, yeah, there we go. Try to reduce my... Uh, I fall here. Can I just go a little further out? There we go. Come on. I know this is excruciating to watch. Ah, yeah, there we go. Doop -ba -doop -ba -doop. Get my, some of my frames back. Except that one. And down we go. Alright, so we're done here. Um, I'm going to get over to Jen, turn that quest in. And uh, I'm going to maybe do some upgrading for the base tonight. Again, I'm having a feeling the Horde Night will be either tonight or tomorrow. And I want to be ready. I want more of this to be concrete. And there's only so much time in the night. I mean, I'll have to do that for mining. So upgrading isn't too bad to do. Okay, I got a lot of stuff to empty out. So I'm going to clear my stuff and get over to Jen. All right, just arrived to Jen. So I get this quest turned in. And I kind of decided on the way when my vehicle ran out of gas. I had some on me, so not a big deal. That I think I should definitely go more into salvage operations. Because uh, fuel is going to be a premium the since there's no the uh, oil shale. Amazing. So we're going to have to consider that. Like I need to wrench a lot of cars to keep this uh, motorbike going. Alright, hunting knife is worth more. And we're going to sell that. And northwest? Or rather northeast. Hmm. Alright, we'll if take north northwest. Me. Whatever, we'll do that. I'll probably nice do that later. I got some upgrading to do. Uh, she reset, I think, a day or two ago. So there's probably nothing new here. Day 22 is our next, our next one. Yeah, I don't see anything... There's a lot of concrete, but I can make my own now. But that is a lot of concrete. But no, I'm going to save my money. Uh, bullets would be nice, but I think I have a fair bit as well. Hmm. Yeah, I don't uh, I don't see anything here I need. You know, Alright, we'll leave that for another day. I'll check this one more time. And I may as well grab the, the canned food since I'm going straight home. And I'll grab the Oshets drops for the uh, next time I do a tower. Like, I still have a Higashi and... Uh, Dishong to do in this uh, series, so <clears throat> I will bring a candy for each one of those. All right, heading home and then upgrading the base and waiting to see if this is a horde or not before I decide to do anything else. All right, before I get started upgrading, I'm gonna make another cement mixer. I had a, an engine in here for my uh, wrenching escapades. I'm gonna grab that battery. I think uh, I think I got room for another battery down here. Oh yeah, there we go. Ooh, well those are really good batteries. Yeah, I don't think I'll need any better batteries than that. I mean, maybe if I get um, another rank... Oh, those are ready. Uh, if I get another uh, rank 6, I'll put it down there and keep hang on to it. But I think we're good for a bit. Uh, let's make some more seeds, if I knew how to spell that. Oh, wait, I don't have... Oh, wait. Oh, I need clay soil. And do I have any of the mushrooms in here? Yes, I do. 
So that's two more seeds. Fantastic. All right, so I got tons of concrete, and I'm going to start um, making some more sand here, maybe 2,000 more. And uh, once that is done, I'm going to start cranking out some more concrete. Oh, there it is. That's the Thundercrack. This is indeed Horde Knight. Well, I'm glad I picked an early enough time to get all this upgraded because uh, it's going to need time to dry. All right, uh, Daft is probably going to do a montage of cement upgrades, so uh, enjoy. Oh, neat, level 44. Um, I mean, I was going to say I was going to put that into, uh, what do you call that? Um, salvage operations, but with Horde Knight impending, I should probably consider... Fortitude. Yeah, I'm going to get Fortitude. So that's going to give us uh, more headshot damage, more dismemberment, and uh, another point that I can get into Machine Gunner. Because, yeah, Machine Gunner is going to be our weapon of choice in this series, and I should really seriously consider um, yeah, using that more, more often and put some points into it. All right, I'm just trying to do as many critical upgrades as I can. You can see the uh, main lane down there has been done. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to continue as many uh, critical spots... That's red. Oh gosh, look at that. Oh, that's ominous. Uh, as many uh, critical upgrades as I can before the, the shit hits the inevitable fan. Alright, I do believe we are out of time. Uh, let's take a look at our weapon stash here. Uh, get some things reorganized. Uh, what I got? I got a couple grenades. Let's use those. Um, let's grab lots of bullets. I don't need those. Lots of bullets, lots of bullets. Um, I'll grab pistol in case the things are really desperate. Uh, shotgun. I don't know. This is way overkill. Uh, what else? What else? What else? Um, medical. Some med kits. I don't know. We're, we're over preparing, but, you know, why not? Um, yeah, I don't see any other explosives or whatnot. All right. This is happening. Uh, that's all on. That's ready to go. Uh, I want to get my big boy out here. Let's get him right front and center. Oh, yeah, we're doing it. We're doing it. Okay, there we go, right there. Uh, pistol, um, grenades, and uh, pump shotgun. Yep, I do believe we are ready. Let's uh, let's get going. Yeah, this looks real nice. I mean, some stuff hasn't uh, dried yet, but uh, I'm sure it will throughout the night. Oh yeah, we're popping heads left and right. I'm definitely not um, regretting putting that point into fortitude. Now, something I want to mention. I, uh, <laughs> I I really should have mentioned this earlier, but I increased the uh, horde. I uh, upped it by 50%. We're now, instead of the default 8, uh, we're now doing 12. So there's an extra 50% horde that we're going to get tonight. Because why not? I think our base is ready. I don't think it's enough for a uh, for grenade, I'd say. Alright, grenade out. Oh yeah, right in there. Boom! Oh, that was a lot of death right there. Look at all those bags piling up over there. We're almost level, and uh, with that in mind, we're going to put that next point into Fortitude right away. Because uh, that's going to give us that advantage. And hopefully we'll get one more level throughout the night. Yeah, let's put that straight away into uh, Fortitude. There, done. Alright, yeah, then I think I'll go up the salvage operations soon. I mean, not a big hurry, because there's a lot of cars out there. But I want to get as much gas as I can, um, so I don't have to worry about running out and no longer having my motorcycle. Well, those dogs got up there fast. If they have enough speed, they can actually get pretty far. But, definitely not getting past, uh, Poundy over there, he's doing a good job. Oh, the hell. Oh, I guess birds can get in. Oh, that's right, I don't have glass up there. 
Well, that explains that. Alright, let's put on uh, Grandpa's Learning Elixir. I just realized I had one of those. For that 20% experience gain for 5 minutes. Let's do it. Oh, speaking of which, grenade. Looks like a good chance. Alright, see how much experience we get for that. Come on, come on, come on. 3,000 experience for a grenade. I like it. I should have made some more of those contact grenades. That would have been fun. Um, actually, what does it take to make those? Contact grenades. Um, gunpowder, forge iron springs, mechanical parts. Yeah, we're not gonna... I'll have that for next time. Because uh, this this could get pretty busy. You know, I just kind of changed my mind. I'm gonna put... Whoa! Dragon birds. Uh, I think I have a two-time scope here. Right, right there. Uh, that would probably make a lot more sense than this uh, reflex site I've been using. Or at least on Horde Knight. Um, there we go. Let's get that reloaded. It's probably gonna make... Yeah, it's, I get a lot more... Gear, yeah, a lot easier headshots. Like... Just like that. I definitely want to conserve ammo. cop coming. No, this uh, base also seems to have you know, the cops pretty well. I mean, yeah, there we go. Um, <laughs> you just take them out quick, you prioritize them, it shouldn't be a big deal. Now, demol demolishers are going to be a bit of a problem, but again, they're going to be shocked, focus fire on their heads, and down they go. But this guy's going to have to move, because if that's there, and a demolisher comes up and makes it that far, that's a definite button push. So, uh, unfortunately, Poundy is going to have to not participate in those Horde Knights. Either that, or I need a redesign of the base where it'll knock him on his other side. But, anyways, I'm not too worried about that. That's a fair, fair bit off, and I may actually make a second base for fun. I mean, a building's a lot of experience, this is my home, and, uh, you know, maybe I'll make a secondary Horde base just to keep things, you know, nice and interesting. Mix things up a bit. Okay, I'm hearing way too many of these friggin' birds. Whoa! Well, I guess the answer is that. Oh, yeah, I'm sprained. Where are ya? Oh, let's get over here. That was a lot of birds. Alright, let's get down there. Oh, that was a break, too. Yikes. Big yikes. Alright, get this clear and go get a... Um, what do you call it? A, a splint. Wait, can I do plaster casts? Ooh, there's a level. Uh, can I do plaster casts? I cannot. I thought, thought I might have found it, but who knows. Oh, I think one of our wires are broken. Let's go check. We got a hammer on us? Yes, we do. I have a little box here that has the uh, electronic and uh, parts here. Um, yeah, those are those are fine. Oh, I think it must be the other side. Hold on, let's take care of uh, Mr. Cop here. Down you go. I'm going to clear out this little pocket. Come on. Reload, reload. I'm uh, pretty sure I have a... Yeah, one of them's definitely broken. You can hear that little buzzing sound. Alright, let's uh, go with that fixed right away. Sprinting, sprinting, sprinting. Uh, no, that's fine. Fine. What? That's... That seems to be the one that's broken. Let me go check the other side again. Uh, are we good over here? Okay, better clear them out again. And one, and two, and three... Gosh, there's a lot of them. Yikes. Reload, reload. I mean, we have plenty of ammo. There's only less than an hour. Or less than two hours, I should say. Before... There we go. The end of the night. So we're, we're not in trouble. By any means. I mean... No, that should be good. The wires are all good. I don't hear the buzzing anymore. Oh, well, it may have just been a glitch. Anyways, let's uh, keep going. All right, let's get that splint done right away. Um, that's an arm break or something. I'm infected, which is also nice. And I guess I can't do anything about that. All right, let's get back down here. We're definitely going to have to take it easy tomorrow.
I think we're starting. I think we're done. I heard that buzz again, so let me just check these posts. Oh, whoa, there it is. I wonder why that would show a short if that one over there was broken. Yeah, that must have been it. Yeah, I think that's it. All right, let's go grab one of our looting candies. Uh, food. Where is it? Oh, eye candy. There we go. Get that started. Let's turn wires off. Make sure our gun's loaded in case we encounter any uh, issues. And a quick hop, which is nervous because I'm... Oh my god, look at all these. Ooh, I may have to empty out first. Uh, okay, steel sledge. A nice hammer. That's way better than this hammer. Nice. I'd love to find a nail gun. Food. Iron. Uh, trophies. Water. Uh, military gear. Leather. Uh, vitamins. Steel armor. Nice. Uh, iron and water. Ooh, steel axe. Yeah, that's a that's a replacement right there. Um, yeah, let me go empty out and get the rest of it. All right, got the last few bags here. There's that leather hood. Uh, bullets, chicken soup. I like it. Vitamins, leather armor, and water, cash. I like cash and iron. Yeah, I think we're good. All right, another successful horde night. I don't see any major damage here. No, just little bits. Like just from random zombies hitting. I heard a lot of thumping outside, or maybe that was upstairs. No, no major damage here. Oh, hold on. A little bit? Ooh, really? Yeah, I'm going to have to re double reinforce these, uh, these posts and maybe put extra ones, because uh, having that collapsed would be bad. All right, one last thing to check. We still have a little bit of time before the morning. Let's see if there's any... Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, the horror. Okay, yep. Yeah, uh, that's... Uh, we need to make a greenhouse. We absolutely need to make, make a greenhouse. That is uh, confirmed what we're doing. I need to make a few farm plots here. Actually, I'll make them on my on myself. Uh, I'll make ten just in case. And I think I have all the resources to fix... What happened up here? Oh man, uh, you warned it about you warned me in the comments, and you were absolutely correct. I mean, there was a bit on both sides. Um, oh, there's, you know, the zombies wouldn't hit, hurt like the two levels above you. That won't happen. Um, I mean, I actually agreed with that because I didn't think so either. But they most definitely did, especially around here where I was standing. They were kind of beelining. I don't think there's any other damage. Okay, my pumpkins are there good. Yeah, it just seemed to be that spot where I was standing. So we definitely need to make a greenhouse kind of uh, before we, the next horde night, ideally. Yeah, that's. Uh, I don't think I lost any crops. Yeah, because I think they're attacking right here, and I didn't have enough potatoes to go all the way over here. At least I don't think so. Oh, I know I lost a couple of blueberries, I think. Oh, well, you know, it could have been a lot worse. Anyways, this has been day 20 of Wasteland Wanderer. We had a good old horde night, lost a couple farm plots, but we got a ton of experience. And uh, just to be true to my word, salvage operations. Uh, I'll get one more point and then put some more points in there and then maybe I'll be done and then turn my attention to some more fortitude. And if uh, the series goes that long, I'm gonna go into intellect and maybe get something in terms of the turrets. Um, sprained arm, it just takes time to heal. All right, I'm done. All right, this has been Genosis again. I uh, want to thank everyone for watching. Like the video if you like what you saw here today. And subscribe if you haven't already. Because there will be lots more madness coming up. Unless I die. But you may want to watch that too. Anyways, have a good night.